Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is another fall home decor haul. I picked up a few things that I thought you guys might wanna see since so many of you love fall just as much as I do. So let's just jump into it. Um, starting off with my favorite item, I cannot get over how gorgeous this is. So this is a kind of like floral centerpiece candle holder type arrangement. There are no flowers, but it has the pumpkins, the leaves, the, these are leaves too, pine cones, and it has these spots for candles. So I do need to get some pillar candles to put in there. And then my favorite part about this are these like little pearls and things that are sticking up and they have some crystals you can see here. So this is so rustic glam, which is just my style. I am so thrilled with this this piece. This was only $24.99 from Home Goods, and they had it in a few different variations. They had a darker one that was like dark grays, and then they also had a traditional one that had orange pumpkins. So these pumpkins are velvet, and these are cream and white. And I actually picked up a very like a similar type of item from Kirkland's, which was $45, and I love it. But I ended up returning it because. It didn't have any glam elements and I wanted something that had both rustic and glam. So I will insert a picture of that one. And because I do love it, but it just didn't offer everything that I wanted. So I ended up going with this one and it says give thanks. It's not too big, maybe like a foot and a half long or maybe even less. So I absolutely cannot get over this. I also picked up this cotton wreath. This is a small wreath, I think it's 13 inches. And this is from Pier One. So I've been wanting a cotton wreath for a very long time, but last year when I went to go get one, like during the fall time, they were all gone. And I didn't want to order one online. So after Christmas time, I was in Pier One and I saw this exact wreath. But I just left it there thinking that I would just pick something up a little closer to fall time. And it was still there when I went back. And so I just picked it up because it was only, I think the tag is off. It was only $9, originally like 20 something dollars. So that's a great deal. Um, the reason why I didn't pick it up right away is because I wasn't sure if I was into how full this is with cotton. Usually the cotton might be a little more spread out along like a wicker or vine wreath, whatever those are called. But actually this ended up being absolutely perfect for the spot that I want to put it. And I'm really, really happy with this purchase. So I don't think these are available online anymore, but you can check your clearance section at your Pier 1s for these. I also saw this exact wreath. It might be a little bit bigger though on Wayfair.com for $70. So to get it for nine is a steal. I also picked up this really pretty candle and cloche. I added these um, twine aspects to it. So it was just a plain cloche before, but I just decorated this morning and it just needed this. So I've been wanting one of these to put over a candle for some time, but I don't really see them too often at my locations of like home goods and stuff and I think I've seen them at at, uh, at home or Hobby Lobby but they I don't know I just wasn't sure of what size to get so I really like that this one actually came with the candle and the candle is mercury glass which is perfect because I use a lot of mercury glass in my decor it was $6.99 for the two of them together I do not like the fragrance of the candle in here it's called ocean breeze and I hate beachy scents but that's okay, um, I'm not gonna actually use the candle anyway. So yeah, I really, really like this. Also from Home Goods, I picked up this really pretty pumpkin candle. And you guys probably won't be able to pick this up on camera, but this is a very unique and beautiful color. It's kind of like a pewter color, but it has a tint of rosiness to it. So it's not like your typical rose gold, bronze, pewter. It's just a very, very unique color. And then the, let's take it out. I don't think it's scented. This was $4.99. And I just really needed something tiny like this for some spots that I have. Sorry about the crinkling noise. I know some of you like it and some of you don't like it. So I'm really sorry. So it's not scented, but 
It does have a little bit of a gr glitter spray on it and you can see that it's kind of just like that rosy pewter kind of grayish metallic and it is so stunning. I'm obviously not gonna like this. This will be used as a decor piece in some way. So um, I found another set of these dish towels. I showed you guys a set in a previous haul and I needed another one and I was lucky to find it. So now I have two. These are so, so pretty. If you haven't already seen that haul, I'll link it in the description box below, but it's like a cream pumpkin with a rose gold metallic outline and then like silver and rose gold leaves on the bottom. You get two towels for $4.99, but the other towel is just plain. It doesn't have that patch, like that pumpkin embroidery on it, so that's why I wanted to get another one. So to go um, with the two plain um, nap or the, the two plain towels, I picked up this towel from Walmart. This was $1.88. I'll insert pictures of the other ones that they have. This is not my color scheme. It is and it isn't. I do like pops of orange, but I'm mostly neutral. So this is kind of like the best of both worlds. It's really pretty linen colored with the gray stripes and the oranges are kind of like rusty oranges. Well, this is, this is straight orange, but this is like a rusty kind of color. And I just love that rusty orange color, so I'm really excited about this. And again, it was only $1.88, and it's just a decorative towel, but it says pumpkin spice makes everything nice. And I actually don't even like the flavor of pumpkin spice a whole lot. I like it a little bit if it's mixed with like vanilla or caramel, but I just love pumpkin, so this is perfect. Um, really, really cute. This is a big towel. So I was thinking that I could hang these two plain ones on my oven and then drape this bigger one over the two of them in the center. So that's my idea for those. And then moving on to Target Dollar Spot. My Target Dollar Spot only has a few Halloween items and it's the kids Halloween items. So I didn't really pick up a whole lot. They do have doggy um, costumes and I'll try to insert clips of the dog costumes that they have but I picked this up for Chip. It's just the little jack-o'-lantern and this is what it looks like on the dog. I got a size medium. I don't I didn't see a size large in any of the costumes. Not that Chip would be a size large but I just wanted to make a note of it for you guys who have larger dogs. This medium fits Chip, but Scottish Terriers are a little bit stocky, so even though he's a small, short, little stubby leg dog, he's a little bit stocky, so this looks super cute on him. If I can put it on him and like snap a photo, I'll try to insert it, but they had a alligator. I think they had like a little convict. Um... For the girl, for girl dogs, they had a Wonder Woman costume, which was so cute. There was only one left, so those must must have gone quickly. I wonder if there were any other characters, but yeah. So I just, you know, I just got this. We do want to make him Batman <laughs> for Halloween, so he may have more than one costume. We'll see. Okay, Chippy. Up, up. Sit. Down. Good boy. Trying to get in here? Oh, you're fine. Hi, you're fine. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> And then the last two items that I picked up are not fall related and I don't know if these came out with the fall collection because some stores do have bits and pieces of the fall collection and some don't. So I don't know if this is new or if it's old but I got these note cards. I always pick up note cards from Target Dollar Spot or Dollar Tree. These are blank. Both of them are blank in the inside and this is what the envelope looks like. Again for one dollar. So that's everything you guys. Thank you for tuning in. If you like this video, sorry that you're like 
uh, lopsided right now. I, I don't know how to work this thing. Um, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe for more fall videos, DIYs, hauls, decor, clothing, um, everything under the sun, recipes, whatever. It's here on this channel and I will see you back in my next video. Bye.